This guy is probably just as busy as me, just back from Germany, and I've just found him in a squash court in Barnsley. What the fuck's going on there, Johnny? Get a fucking bout, don't we? We'll get a bout. But this is what it's all about. I mean, the superstar fights, so, uh, one in the blue moon. The little fights, day to day, these are what I'm all about. Um, for about four hours sleep, and then we're back out on the road again. Three lads on today. Um, How many lads you got on today? Got three. Got three, who are they? Chris and Simon Jenkinson, they're trained uh, by Matt at Elite's Gym uh, in Bolton. And I've got Stuart Maddox trained by myself. He'll be God help you, Stuart. He'll be right. They'll all be right. They'll all be right. Then. Yeah, of course. How was Germany then? Fantastic experience. So me and Matt travelled over, um, met everybody there. Brilliant experience. Good for hospitality, aren't they, Germany? They're fantastic for hospitality. Not great on the scoring, but they're good for hospitality. Well, they're better than the fucking French, to be fair. Yeah? Yeah, the French fucked it up, didn't they? They had us losing by four rounds, yeah. and uh, everybody else. Well, it, I mean, it was a close fight, yeah. but to win it in Germany, he would have had to win, like, by about six, seven rounds. Wouldn't he? Yeah, I, I don't think it was hard done by, by any stretch of the imagination. Um, I, I was quite happy with... with with everything to be honest I was quite happy with everything um, the performance was unbelievable the game plan and we know as a team that we can compete at that level and that, that, that's the main thing yeah he didn't he done himself well didn't you know and his chance will probably come again definitely definitely we've had a few rumours and a few people have said a few things but it's, it's all good for us because it puts him into that uh, nice high bracket which we have always believed he, he deserves to be in well done, Martin. Great performance. So, back here in the squash court in Barnsley with Chris. Who are you fighting, Chris? A lad called Ryan Hardy. He's oh, he said he was going to knock you out him. I said him before. Did he? Well, we'll see you then. That's <laughs> what he said, Johnny. Well, that's not right, is it? Okay, no, it's not right. It's not right saying that about our Chris. <laughs> Does he train you? Johnny? Yeah. No, I'm trained by Alex. Thank God for that. Yeah, he's got a chance. I do, I do a bit with Johnny as well. Uh, down at Oliver's gym. It's a good gym, Oliver, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I get the best of both worlds. What's your record, Lord? I've had I've had one fight, one draw. It was a controversial draw, but uh, you know, everyone who came, I took a lot of fans down to Preston, and I thought I actually won, and so did everyone else. So, Wicked. so it's all right. Well, good luck tonight. Today, well, today in the afternoon show, sure, I haven't been to bed yet, Johnny. I was up all night watching the Cotto fight. Fuck you, now that was, what was that like? I didn't get to see any of that. Yeah, it was all right, it was good. And uh, Johnny Murray, did, he did well, but he got stopped in the 11. Did he show any different variety in, the, in his boxing? Uh, yeah. he, did, he did well. Oh, good. War. Yeah, can you, can you imagine, can you imagine? Well, it hasn't been the best weekend for the Brits, but they all did the self proud, and let's hope these lads can do the same today, innit? That's the one, Jane. In a bit, Johnny Roy.